Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. A pivot chart shows the data from an associated pivot table in a graphic format. You can create a pivot chart along with an associated pivot table in Excel. You can then manipulate the pivot chart data in the same way that you manipulate the pivot table data. Starting in Excel 2013, you can also choose to decouple a pivot chart from its associated pivot table if needed. You can create a pivot chart as you create a pivot table in Excel, or you can add a pivot chart to an existing pivot table if you didn't create one when you initially created the pivot table. One way to create a pivot chart is to click the Pivot Chart drop-down button that appears within the Charts button group on the Insert tab within the ribbon. You can then select Pivot Chart to insert only a pivot chart, or select Pivot Chart and Pivot Table to insert both objects. Excel will then launch the Create Pivot Chart dialog box. This dialog box is exactly the same as the Create Pivot Table dialog box. Once you've finished making your choices within this dialog box, and then click the OK button to continue, Excel will then insert a pivot chart and possibly an accompanying pivot table into the location that you selected within the workbook. You can then add fields from your data source to the various areas within the pivot chart or the pivot table. If you inserted both objects, note that changes that you make within one of the items will also be reflected within the other. When you select the pivot chart, you can add data fields into the quadrants shown within the pivot chart fields task pane. Note that this task pane functions in the same way as the pivot table fields task pane does. The quadrants are filters, legend or series, axis or categories, and values. You can also add a pivot chart to an existing pivot table within Excel. To do this, simply click into any cell within the pivot table to which you want to add an accompanying pivot chart. Then click the pivot chart button within the charts button group on the insert tab within the ribbon. Excel will then display the insert chart dialog box. Here you will select the chart type and specific subtype that you want to use for your pivot chart. Then click the OK button to insert the selected chart into the worksheet. You can then use the Pivot Table Field Task Pane to manipulate the pivot chart and its associated pivot table. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.